On today's episode of Camper, rest and relaxation at a new Barra impoundment. Our second ARB prize giveaway, it's an awning, but first, time for a laugh. Locals have been loving this place hard for years, but until recently, they had to pack up and go home when the sun went down, but not anymore. Lake Callide Retreat is operated by Banana Shire Council. Affordable lakeside accommodation options include five self-contained cabins, powered sites for caravans and camping sites, all located just a stone's throw from the water. For caravanners, there's power, water, a shared ensuite bathroom with expansive views of the dam and free barbecues. Of course, wherever you go, my number one tip is to make friends with a local fisherman as they'll know what's biting and where to go. And that's where Nigel comes in. There's a bit of a barra highway here. There's an old, old creek bed that runs through Dino. It runs up and in the back here. There's a couple little points that come off and the barra just love cruising up and down here when you get the right water temp. Get the sun on these cliffs, get that water temp up a little bit. You're out of the wind a bit in here, but you just throw those lures in, nice slow twitches, and you'll be smacking them all day long. Nigel Kruger spends a great deal of time stocking and fishing Lake Calide, so this fishing trip is going very well so far. I think it's an amazing thing to be able to do. We use some of our SIPs money, uh, stock impoundment money, so we get money from people's licences uh, for a stock impoundment licence that goes into um, been able to give us some money to put some fish in this dam, but all the rest of the money we just fundraise. So we're we're out doing barbecues, we're doing our comp. Our big comp in October is our one that brings our money in, and um, we put 100% of that money, whatever money we make, goes straight back into fish. So we're just passionate about seeing this dam become a dam full of good quality fish that uh, we can just see people come and get and just get smashed on them and just love them. So um, Barramundi is my my love. So I love seeing Barramundi go into this dam. You know, these barra aren't playing the game today, mate. The thing I love about Calloid, there's always a backup plan, mate. I guarantee you, we're gonna go around the corner and we're gonna get a feed. Oh, hello. What have we got here? Yeah, we've got a few there, mate. Red claw. Never leave without a feed, mate. That's my motto. <laughs> Never leave without a feed. Well, I'll tell you what, there'll be uh, caravanners watching this. I know the Fairburn Dam, which is not too far from here, uh, just up the road a little bit uh, towards Emerald is stock solid with these things, but you get plenty of them here as well. Yeah, yep. So these guys, these guys here get a good size range right throughout the dam. Um, four to five metres is usually the go-to. And uh, but these guys, I've got caravanners to come here and they'll just load up. They fill their freezers and they travel right through, um, score a few fish on the way and they enjoy it. So, but they beautiful eating, unreal on the barbie, a little bit of garlic butter in there and uh, just sizzle them down one side and straight out and in down the hatch, mate. Now, I did mention at the start that the fun used to end when the sun went down, but that's not the case anymore with the new accommodation. My partner in crime on this trip through the sandstone wonders of this region is a local by the name of Frank Smallwood, who's going to show us around over the next few days. He absolutely loves the place. Tell us a little bit about uh, this setup because it's ideal. You know, if you don't have a caravan or a swag or a tent, there's still magni magnificent accommodation here, isn't there? Yeah, look, um, Lake Hallow Retreat, fantastic place. You know, council had the forethought to um, to make the most of the Calloid Dam, and uh, and this is the result. It's beautiful. And there's nothing better than a fire and a starry night. It's going to be a great week in the Sandstone Wonders region, in and around the Banana Shire, and you'll see plenty more of this fabulous part of Queensland over the next few episodes of Camper. 
Bookings for Lake Calide can be made by emailing caretaker at lakecaliderretreat.com or by going to the Lake Calide Facebook page or website. And for more info on this spectacular region, check out sandstonewonders.com or the OQTA website. Our next camper giveaway is a beauty, an ARB canvas awning for your next off-road adventure. Keeping you cool in the dry and dry in the wet, ARB awnings are a must-have for a day at the beach or a night in the bush. ARB awnings feature anodized height-adjustable telescopic legs, Velcro ties, all secured and free from the outside elements in a heavy-duty nylon reinforced PVC bag. Fully waterproof and with a UVP rating of 50 plus, the ARB awning comes in three sizes and is yours to win. Follow the link to enter the competition and to increase your number of entries, just follow the prompts. The more entries you have, the more chance of winning and you've got to be in it to win it. The prize will be drawn on Friday, August 3. Register now and good luck.